we have this mnemonic ASTC hmm. all science teachers are crazy what this means is that sign cos tan all are positive hmm. only sign and secant are positive the rest secant cos tan cot are negative any doubt avadi ga need to no here only tan and his brother cot they are positive hmm sin cosecant cos secant are negative hmm crazy cos secant are positive okay sin cosecant tan cot negative are negative okay read up no so now they'll ask you just for practice i'll be giving you few questions so all that you need to remember is for example they'll ask you uh, let, let, let us assume uh, okay let me do few examples so for example they'll ask you uh, uh, 245 degree or they'll ask you 325 degree tell us the sign uh, sign this sign the sign of sign cos tan have you understood the question okay yeah so all that you need need to understand is that in which quadrant is 245 245 degrees in which quadrant is one thing 245 would be uh, third third quadrant so in third quadrant which is positive third quadrant uh wait So I'm going on none. Ah, uh, okay. I'm confused. One second. Yeah. No Only tan is positive. Yeah. Only tan is positive. Yeah. yeah. So only tan is positive. Hmm. So sin and cos would be negative. Negative. Any doubt? No. So it's pretty easy. We'll just do three more questions and you'll understand. Three twenty-five degrees in which quadrant? Fourth. Fourth quadrant. Yeah. So. Only one would be positive. Cos. Cos. So only cos would be positive. The rest mm. would be negative. Any doubt? No. Okay. Now let us take. Uh, let us say five forty degrees. So five forty degrees. Can you tell me which, in which order it will be? Five forty. One second. Assume, let us assume five fifty degrees. Okay. Um, third quadrant. Five fifty minus three sixty nine four three one. So this will be third quadrant. In yes. third quadrant, which is positive? Uh, positive is uh, tan. Only tan would be positive, hmm. sine and cos would be negative. Any doubt? Yeah, no. And of course, this what this implies is that cot would also be positive, and cosecant and secant would also be negative. Any doubt? Mm -hmm. No. So we till now we have done two things. One is we have extended the value. we have done uh, extended the value of uh, uh, cos and sin are you okay mm. yeah any doubt no so this is what we did we defined the value of cos as x by r we defined the mm -hmm. value as y by r yeah. yeah and using this we can define the value of tan as uh, y upon y by r any doubt till here no so this is the first thing that we have done yeah hmm the second thing that we have done is we have understood the signs of uh, the trigonometric uh, functions in different yeah. forms and we have uh, two mnemonics one is all science teachers are crazy 
the other mm -hmm. one is after school after school to college, college. yeah so whichever you prefer you can remember there are other mnemonics also in the market mm -hmm. lot of mnemonics are there okay uh once we have done this once we have done this then we need to understand the trigonometric functions of specific angles mm 